Close! Stay focused, Sam! Double team! <gasps> I won! You won! <laughs> Seek it! All you have to do is stay focused and every- <gasps> Are you even paying attention? I'm paying enough attention to see that! The plate crest! Director Scratch has a new creature case for us! <laughs> ah! Who rules the roost now? <laughs> <clears throat> Uh, director. <coughs> Eagles! We've got a new creature case in the North American forest. The My Squad just sent us this strange footage. Huh, is it just me? Or are there a lot of falling trees in that forest? That's exactly what's happening. And it's endangering the local animals. It's up to you two to figure out why the trees are falling down. You can count on us, Director. Good luck, agents. Yeah, Peggy's in the zone. Now approaching destination Bio <laughs> North American Forest. Better bring Ron in for a landing, Sam. Uh, I don't know if we can land here. There are a lot of trees and plants in the way. Sure we can. Just back up a little. Okay, a little forward. Just a little back. A little forward. Uh, Sam, I don't know if we can land here. There are a lot of plants in the way. That's what I was saying. Maybe over there. So quiet. Are we in the right spot? I don't see any falling trees. Kid, look out! Uh. <gasps> oh, that was a close one. What is going on here? I'll tell you what's going on. These falling trees are scaring away all my customers. No one wants to live here with trees falling all over the place. It's not safe. Trees are falling. Yeah, they're falling. What's to be done? What are we going to do? Don't worry, everyone. We're from Clay, and we're going to get to the bottom of this. Besides the falling trees, has anyone noticed anything unusual lately? I noticed that my second toe is longer than my big toe. Okay. Anyone else? <sighs> Sorry, my bad. Everybody okay? Uh, 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 <sighs> could be better. Hmm. Aha! Kit, how does it feel to be in the presence of a master detective? Why, you see one around? I mean me. I've noticed another clue. Look at where we're standing. Under a tree? Exactly! All the rhino rages started under trees! Show her, Cluebot! Well, ain't that something? So there's a four-pod critter on the loose, jumping out of trees and scaring the rhinos! I think I saw it running away! You did? What it looked like, Reggie? Well, it was small, almost like a cat, with a pointy face and dark uh -huh. spots. Uh -huh. uh, like this? Yeah! That's it, but the... Uh, Without the go-kart. Yeah, I just like drawing go-karts. Hmm, a spotted cat creature. Sounds like a leopard to me. A leopard? You better be pulling my horn. Leopard? There's a leopard on the loose! Not so fast, Sam. This was no leopard. Look, the spots don't match, see? We can't risk it. If there's even a chance a leopard is attacking folks, I gotta shut down the watering hole. Aww. Hold up, Reggie. You might be able to keep the party going. If we can just figure out... The bugs! 
Whiskers, that's it! What's it? Kit, I know who's jumping on the rhinos. And I know how to catch her too. Sam, this decoy looks pretty real. There's even bugs buzzing around it, just like a real rhino. But what's the plan here? Isn't it obvious? We're setting a trap. Someone with four muddy paws is jumping out of trees and onto the rhinos to eat the bugs. Of course. It must have been. <laughs> the jam that we met earlier. Whoa. There she goes. <laughs> Somewhere. Hi. All right, this is it. The mice squad's last known location. <gasps> Kit, would you stop humming and help me look for them? I'm only humming to keep warm. <sighs> Not all of us like the cold as much as you do. Including the mice squad, which is why we better find them fast. Can't argue with that. Come on. No sign of them, or their van. No sign of much of anything. Oh, ah! What was that? Over there! A herd of musk oxen! Maybe they've seen Bill and Jill. Let's go! Go, go, go! What are they doing? Don't worry about it, Sam. Butting heads is what musk oxen do. Hello there. I don't suppose you've seen... Protect the children! Whoa, 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 easy, folks. I'm not a wolf. I'm a snow leopard. And I'm a fox. Well, that isn't much better. Who are you and what do you want? We were just wondering if you had seen our friends? No, we haven't. Unless your friends are wolves. <laughs> then we haven't seen anyone come through here. Are you sure? Maybe you've heard them playing their music or seen their van. She said we haven't seen him. We must oxen keep to our herd, and we don't mess with outsiders. He's right. We don't have time for anybody else. If we get even the slightest bit distracted, it could put our calves in danger. But maybe... You'd better move along before we move you along. <laughs> Talk about a cold shoulder. Well, if we can't get any information out of the musk oxen, then maybe we should track down the wolves they mentioned. Good idea, Kit. Scanning for wolf prints. Aha, there. The wolves are heading that way. I see them. Whoa, they're moving pretty fast. We've got to catch up with them. But how? The stinkwells. Hello, Kit. Hello, Sam. Hey, hey Stinkwells. We are so worried about Bill and Jill. Have you found them yet? Not yet, but we're tracking some wolves who might have some clues. And we need to go fast. We had a feeling this might happen. That's why we packed some special vehicles for you in Ron. We'll send them to you now. Sorry, he does that when he's worried. Ah, there they are. Snow cycle! They're beautiful. Thanks, Stinkwells. You're welcome. Good luck. <laughs> oh. Nowhere left to slither now, Viper. Hell listen, I told you before, huh? I'm just an egg-eating snake. <laughs> I'm not dangerous. Nice try, but you're actually a venomous, sore-scaled Viper. You sure, Sam? Egg-eating snakes and vipers look a lot alike, and they're hard to tell apart. Check it out, Kit. The pattern on his scales looks just like the pattern on the hat we found. Hey, my hat! 
I, I mean, that don't prove nothing. And remember the snake scale we found? Well, guess who has a bald spot on his head? Whoa, that's embarrassing. Well, ain't that something. He's a saw-scaled viper, all right. And he's the biter. He tricked us. Okay, okay, so I'm a viper, but, but I didn't mean to bite the engineer. She startled me and, and I snapped. It's just my nature. Easy now. We just need a little of your venom. My venom? Why? I can use it to make medicine for the engineer. So she can stop this train before it crashes. <laughs> you want my venom? Come on, get it! <laughs> oh no, you don't! All venom death, Viper. At least for a little while. <laughs> nice work, Kit. Thanks. Now come on, let's get back to the engineer. We don't have much time. I hope they hurry. We're gonna crash. Uh, oops, is this my car? <laughs> Oh. Hurry, 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 hurry! Just need a teensy bit of viper venom, my secret blend of herbs and spices. <laughs> hurry, kids! There! The perfect snake bite medicine. Oh. Ooh. It's working! She's waking up! Oh, oh good morning! Chief! I know you just woke up, but you got to stop the train before we crash! Sweet slippery slugs! I got to stop the train! <laughs> Look out! left alone, and that she was last seen wearing a crown. Now, the princess must be heading past the boundaries of the palace. Okay, but why? Because she wants to start her own mole rat colony. That's why she left alone, and why she was wearing a crown. Whiskers, that's it. She's going to make her own palace and become a new mole rat queen. Exactly. Woo -hoo. But we're not the only ones looking for her. Woo -hoo. We gotta find her before that hungry owl does. Which way to the closest palace border? This way! <gasps> and there's the princess! Princess, get to cover! <laughs> princess, <laughs> dig! <laughs> She's not gonna make it underground in time! Oh yes she will! Blue box, dig! <laughs> Princess, are you all right? I'm just marvelous. Thank you for your help. But I'm not a princess anymore. I'm now a queen. And this will be my new palace. The nursery chamber will go there. And the toilet chamber over there. Good news, Your Majesty. Your daughter is safe and sound. Oh, thank goodness. Hello, Mother. Oh, sorry I lived in such a rush. I just couldn't wait to be queen and start my own kingdom. Your own kingdom? I'm so proud of you. I could cry tears of joy. <laughs> <laughs> Another creature case closed. closed. Oh, princess. Oh, thank the mighty tubers. You're safe. Please, Worthy. Gather some food for our guests. We're having a royal feast. A royal feast? What are we having? <laughs> Looks like your favorite, Sam. <laughs> Sweet potatoes! Uh. <laughs> hmm. If it's good enough for a queen, it's good enough for me. <laughs> Tree bark! Is it a clue? I think so. When there's not much food around, snowshoe hares will eat the bark right off trees. Huh? Sounds like someone's having a little bark snack now. 
could it be? What's up, agents? You again. Who? Oh, oh yeah, me. <laughs> Snowball, are you sure you haven't seen a hare with brown fur? Absolutely positive. Brown fur would really stick out on all this snow, eh? Well, good luck. <sighs> we still haven't found a single clue. Maybe those hairs counted wrong? Maybe. Though I'm starting to feel like we're missing something. Hey, what's this? Looks like a snow burrow. The kind of missing hair would hide in. Hello? Anyone home? More bark. I think someone's in there. Could it be? Boom! <gasps> Snowball! <laughs> I got you guys good! Snowball, we don't have time for games. This is a serious investigation. And how'd you get here? We saw you go the other way. I told you, I'm good at blending in. You didn't see me sneak back here. This is my snack shack. Hold up, Snowball. You're sure that there are no other hairs around here? Well, there were more of us here earlier. <laughs> Wonder where they all went. <laughs> now it's just me and that. Wolf! <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go. What in the bully? After that hair! Wait, what? I think Snowball might be the camper we've been looking for. Snowball? But his fur's the wrong color. Not all of it. He's got a brown spot on his back. <laughs> We're not the only ones after him! Better hurry! What? Oh no! Poobot, go! Whoa! Thanks for the lift! Snowball! You're the missing camper we've been looking for! I am? But weren't you looking for someone with brown fur? Wait, my fur changes to brown for half the year. Oh, how did I forget that? Howler monkeys are known for being pretty loud. We're from Clade, and we'd like to ask the manager a few questions. Ah, he's already being interviewed. Is that guy with you? Huh? Another detective? Who is that guy? Excuse me. I'm Agent Kid Casey, and this is Agent Sam Snow. And you are? Philip. Philip Knight, nocturnal detective. When you want a case solved, I'm the night monkey for the job. Okay. Night monkey? I thought we were dealing with howler monkeys. Night monkeys are a whole different species. We're nocturnal, see? Which means we only work at night, see? And I only work alone. Look, Philip, it's been very nice to meet you, but we've been sent here to crack this case. Sorry, kid, but this is my case. Uh, maybe we could work together. Oh, fine, but just don't get in my way. Sir, can you tell us what happened here? Well, I... Notice anything strange? Strange? Uh, I... Maybe just start from the beginning and... Listen here, pal. Just what are you trying to hide? Okay, okay. I confess. One time I took a twisty straw from the kitchen, but I was going to bring it back. A straw? No. We're trying to find out what's poisoning your guests. Was it you? Me? No. I love our guests. We're like a big family here. Well, did you serve them any unusual food lately? Anything poisonous? Not that I know of. We only serve leaves here. And we've never had any problems with them. Until yesterday. It seems there's no other explanation. 
If leaves are all they ate, then... Then the leaves must be poisonous. Hey, I was about to say that. But that's impossible. We've been eating these leaves forever. We better do a poison scan. Leave it to me, kid. I got a nose for this sort of thing. Why don't we both check the leaves and see who can get to the bottom of this mystery first? You're on. It's the leaves. I'm sorry, Mr. Manager, but these leaves you're serving are poison. Definitely poisonous. <laughs> Twist my tail. There's no sign of that USO anywhere. Hey, and come to think of it, there's no sign of Wally either. Wally, where'd you go? Over here. I'm all stuck in this sticky stuff. <laughs> Hey, this stuff looks like it's made out of webbing. It could be an empty egg sack from a moth. Or a spider. The USO! Quick, after that unidentified shiny object! Did it! You caught the USO! I did? <laughs> hey! I did! Ooh. Hey! What's the big idea? Yep, the USO's a spider. A mama spider, thank you very much. So that was your egg sack we found. Sure it was. Look, there's a whole bunch of babies on her back. Oh. Aren't they precious? <laughs> Whiskers, that's it. The light from the fireflies and our flashlights was reflecting off their eyes, making the USO shine. Ah, so that's what was causing all the trouble. Trouble? I didn't know we were causing any trouble. I was just going for a little walk with my babies. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, ma'am. As long as you and your baby steer clear of the firefly prom, there shouldn't be any more problems. This time, nothing's going to stop me. Ahem. Um, care to dance? See, I told you, UFOs and USOs are just mysteries waiting to be solved. Uh, Sam? What's that? Huh? <laughs> I cry for a wallet! <laughs> I'm alright! The Creature Cases Now on Netflix